OK, you're in Microsoft Excel and you want to extract the numeric part of a text string. Now, in this video, we're going to use a function called regex extract. If you don't see that function in your version of Excel, don't worry. I've done another video that explores other solutions to this problem. I'll leave a link to that video in the description of this video. Now to use regex extract, we have to use what's called a regular expression. And I've provided the regular expression that we're gonna need in this workbook. And I'll also leave that regular expression in the description of this video. Now I can't pretend to be an expert in regular expressions. I in fact asked ChatGPT to devise the regular expression for me. And I did that just by going into ChatGPT and asking a simple question like this, create a regex to extract numbers from a text string, keep decimal places with number. Now I did have to develop the regex a little bit further. And this is the breakdown of the regex that I finally arrived at. Anyway, let's see how we can use this regular expression or regex within our formula. So I'm gonna copy the regex and I'm in B2 equals regex extract. So the first argument is text. So that asks you to point at the text that you want to extract characters from, comma. And this is where you put your regular expression. It has to go in speech marks, comma. And then the return mode is important. Here, you have the option to either return the first match, which would just return the invoice number, or all matches. And that's what we want to do. We want to return the invoice number and the monetary amount. So we're going for all matches. Now, the last argument there, case sensitivity, is not going to be relevant to us. So we just close the bracket, press Enter, and you can see that it returns both the invoice number and the amount. And if I copy this down, it will do so for the other text strings. Now you can see it spilled the two numeric values into separate columns. If you wanted to combine both numeric values in one cell, then you'd have to use the text join function. So I'm going to copy my regex extract formula. And over here, I'm going to use text join. The delimiter I want to use, well, I'll say that that's a colon and a space that has to go in speech marks. Ignore empty, I'll just leave as the default. And text one is going to be my regex formula. Close the bracket at the end, press enter, and you can see it's combined both numeric values in one cell. Okay, that's all I wanted to cover in this particular video. Hopefully that's useful. If it is, please give me a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll see you next video.